Hi guys, this is just going to be a really quick video demonstrating how Windows Update can be a resource hog and a leech, which is kind of in violation of the standard practice when it comes to updating software. My network is maxed out, I do have a down speed of 4 Mbps, I know, yeah, that's really low, but um, that's not the point. We are currently downloading updates, and I just want you to know that I didn't start this process, it was automatic. And as you can see, we are also downloading something on Google Chrome. And the speed here is quite low. And if we check in Task Manager, under Processes, you're gonna notice that Windows is the culprit. It is taking up a higher percentage of my network speed as compared to what I'm trying to do manually, which is download another program. Now normally when you run an update, let's say you're updating your AV program or some kind of software, they concede resources to other applications because, well, what's more important, you getting your work done or um, the system getting updated? Usually it gives you the preference since you're the user. And that's how it works um, in most applications, and especially with the operating system, because the operating system's always running. So if it prioritizes itself, you might not be able to get anything else done. But this is just reminiscent of the new Windows as a service. So now it gives itself updating more priority than you trying to do something else. And in itself, it is a problem. It's a minor problem for some people, major problem for some who have really slow internet and they don't want Windows updates to hog up their resources all the time. But um, the greater concern here is the shift in paradigm in terms of how an operating system should behave or how a company's product should behave. So at this point, they are trying to take control away from you and into their hands. So you're now using the operating system, but you don't have complete control over it. And uh, this is just part of that approach, which is why it's more troubling. It's not a simple glitch. It's not just that they've decided to prioritize updates because, well, security is a big concern. It is that they don't think that you should have complete control of your operating system. So this can easily get out of hand and uh, slowly descend into a situation where your operating system has more control over you than you over it. And that is kind of a dystopian future that you probably don't want to get into. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. This is Leo and I'll catch you in the next one.